Hello everyone and welcome to the tutorial on creating a door using Doom in Hexen format. So what we're going to do here first is create two 640 by 640 sectors. So let me draw a 640 by 640 sector out here. Okay, and now we'll just go ahead and go into sector mode and copy this one over. So control C, control V. And we'll put it about 64 units away. And all right, accept that by pushing enter. And now we're going to draw a sector here in the middle that connects them. This will serve as our door. So 64 by 128. All right. Okay. Now we'll go into sector mode, select this door here, drop the ceiling to zero. And now we'll change the ceiling texture to more of a door texture. So we'll come to base and we'll go down to flat 20 and we'll push OK and push OK again and now we're going to set up the actual effect for the door so we'll jump into lines mode select the two lines for the outsides of the door right click and first off we're going to go ahead and just make this in a repeatable effect because this player a player is going to be using a door often so with the repeatable effects set, we'll go ahead and go into and click the action button. Then we want a door, so we're going to click door. And we'll go to door raise. And we'll push OK. And now you see we get all these properties down here we can set. We're going to leave the sector tag as zero because if we leave it at zero, it will affect the geometry it's already attached to. We're going to change the movement speed to 16 and we're going to change the close delay to 128. So that's pretty much a basic door and we need to go ahead and set up the trigger now so we can decide how the, how the player is going to actually trigger this door to work. So we'll come here and we'll actually select player press use. Alright so now that that's set up let me come into the side depths real quick come to the upper texture and change that to a door texture so we know it's a door big door 2 is fine push OK and we'll push OK again now we'll push C to clear our selection now one last thing we need to do is select these two other lines and set these to lower on passable or lower on pegged I'm sorry and we need to change their texture so we'll come here to the middle texture to something more of like a door track or or door stop texture so now that I know the texture I'll just go ahead and type it in here door stop alright so we have that and we'll push OK and we'll push OK again alright now let's go ahead and add our player start here face it towards the door alright and now we're ready for testing okay so here we are in the map and we'll go ahead and walk over to the store here and push use on it and there we go we got a simple door working here walk through we got that delay and it lowers again walk back up and it works from both sides so now we'll go back into the editor alright so with that we've covered creating a simple door so that'll pretty much wrap up this lesson. Thank you for watching.